I wonder if I can go here and soak step over. Oh boy. Can you? Oh, you can. What? Damn it. Um. Oh, you have a fire chicken. I forgot about that. Splinter blast. Okay, well, that did nothing. Um, in fact, why don't we just run all the way to the weapons? Yeah, here, Tattooed. Shingle for a company called Black Tree Arms. Scatter of weapons and things. Tattooed this way. Across the fairground, canvas sags, sa canvases sag and tall poles topple. Terrible things happen be behind the smoke, and that's only by the nerves, the noise of gurgling death and triumphing hollers. Retreat is always part of their plan, but they'll guard their, f but they'll guard their flank. If you line your pockets a little extra, that'd be fun. Be ready. Let's go. Um. Oh, no, no. <laughs> Please leave Erotica alone. <sighs> of course. Sorry, my love. So Erotica can't die tonight this anymore. Uh tattooed. Come on over. Nope. Okay. Forty-six, twenty-three. If I go here. Eighty. Sure, I'll take that one. Dead. Do 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 smack. Moving on up. I was gonna say they, own, they can only come from here, right? Tattooed, move all the, move up. Guardian. Uh, 
Yeah, we'll bring it. We'll let them come to us. <laughs> Maybe. One hit. Ow. Ow. Constrict. Um, go here. Fire. Okay. Smack him. Pretty sure you can finish a mob tattoo. Smack! Black tears drip from chins from the smoke stained faces of survivors who huddle st staring. Tattooed, go fill up some, ta some kettles with water. I'll guard this place. Right, I'm an ox, my mother says. Say, put me to work. The full horror won't be known until all the blazes burn out. Fire crouches in the ribs of shredded taints feasting on fine goods making ash of art. The smoke's getting bad in my lungs. May your bodies be earth-eaten and fed and feed the ants. Your death shrouds lie heavy on you. Root and rock. It was a cowardly cruel attack, but you know what? I blame that boasting fair master, fair master just as much. If you're done go cursing ghosts, come along. Our anger will drive us on, but we don't piss at all. Uh, piss it all out in uh, under graves. Let's get out of the danger, you and me. Wait, I'm getting all twisted up. Kind of trying to find some way to basically to basically say I want to kiss you. So what do you think of that? I think the sooner we stop poking around the point, the sooner we can learn if we hate each other or like each other. All right, water's here. Suppo suppose the fire's next. Best to build it close to the creek? Hmm, smart move. Let's move everyone that way. Evening's near. The knife-shaped moon briefly shines, then gets swathed in gray. Erotica did all the hard work. Couldn't find any more survivors, though. All my livelihood was there. Night smooths in the, the world with shadows, leaving a cool blanket where bla black uh, creases had caught their eye. Woods-dwelling owls called out the moon's name. Did a perimeter like you told me, Sir Bob, and did some of your double backs. <laughs> double backs, pussy. These dwar the these dwarven gone. Of course they're gone. Wouldn't it, wouldn't have sent you alone if I had any doubt. I see. Explain to me the thinking behind you were getting in my hair. Anyways, you look like you wanted to be busy. Wanted to be busy. No one has to listen to her, you know, miserable mother. Probably not the right person to take direction from. Have to listen to someone, Erotica. Sorry if, if, but I mean, Sir Bob said. It's fine, just know that my, my, my Sir Bob isn't doing anything without a reason. Why don't we let her t tell us what really brought her here in, in time for the show? Reasons are a fine place to start. Night's a long way from over. Erotica's yes, I didn't come home alone only to reconnect with my daughter. But you can afford to hear the details as we go. Hmm? Go where? Sir Bob wants me to follow them. Uh, the Dwarven who fled and I, I do worry who will make sure these poor folks get where they're going safe and fed and blanketed and so on but the adventurous part of me is convinced that uh, that out there out there's where I do most the most good I wouldn't have looked for a conventional tracker but <laughs> Pussy's family is unique it felt for two for two to us the next day he sees them already embarking through the forest Prince Prince is scarce and muddled here. Seems to have a purpose staged. A split where the ground's hard. <laughs> they left. The survivors of the fair organized and guided by the most sensible hands among them. Themselves re recipients of Sir Ba's party. Every day, simple streamer. Trying to stream to the world. <laughs> Feel, it feels like it's time to name this little group, right? It's, it's something of a tradition. Oh, here we go, chat. 
we get to name the group of the name of the group for this entire story. It will become a kind of currency if you nurture it and grow tall. Buy his beds, wines, meals, you, you'll learn erotica about the exchange of worthy names. Someday I'll tell you about yours. They, p they path forward in long silence, then... It's that night as they, they're stewing bird's meat and wild duck roots. Then an idea sticks. The nugget eaters? Sure! The moose people. What? He always likes to suggest, suggest something moose, don't worry. Well, what's the other options? Cranes of the Lake, Kinsmen of the Panther, Titan's Beauty. Should we call ourselves the Nugget Eaters? With an exclamation mark? <laughs> I'm down for this. Tattooed isn't in the group anyways until he dies. <laughs> Which can happen. You can lose characters here. Love it. Alright. <laughs> Nugget eaters it is. So begins the tales of the Nugget Eaters. The Nugget Eaters, you know, I actually like it. It's pretty memorable. Wait, really? Hmm. Summer follows spring. Uh, spring follows winter. Winter follows fall. Shadows follow moonrise, follows sunshine, follows squall. And fire one day follows fire. We love nuggets. Yes. <laughs> All right, uh, so I guess it's time to start exploring. We have not much to explore, so we start scouting here. See if we find friends. Okay, no friends. Um... No, I want to. I kind of want to heal first, some more. Cause the last thing I need, I don't want anyone to die. Neurotica's already on like death's door. All right. So we'll go do this, and then we'll go deal with this. We must risk moving in daylight, gain distance, be ready to march to the feather's breath. A band of human trackers bring numbers unknown, burns at their heels. It has the dwarven both surprised and a little fearful. Versah! Oh, have you calmed down? Imagine being flinchy at that size. The question, why my free you gave? You lack the language to understand, even were I to explain every intricacy. Just trust me, the driving sec did not pull, didn't pull this troop together for no reason. Past their prime, tale truers maybe, but braiding is their life, their history, and the aim of their ever lives. What's the meaning is, Dreadsack, what is that? You really like that sword, don't you? That'll either be a problem or, or it'll make him popular. Dreadsack is a name you must learn. He was my elder, my teacher, one of the last great devons of our lore. I am merely his shadow. We move in Dreadsack's honor. Yes, you owe your freedom not to me, but to the, his wisdom and the respect he commanded. In moments, they'll be underway again. Meanwhile, that's smoke! The days have been grueling. Always the, dwar always the dwarven are ahead, leaving spare sign behind them of having lit a leaf, much less slept. If it's plainly visible, that means we need to avoid approaching it directly. Come at an angle, or we'll be giving them both our flanks. You're really verse that verse in war? In fighting dwarven. Dwar yeah. Don't be impressed. Doesn't want to tell you, but she and, and that fair master Starshale, student and teacher. <sighs> yeah, well, that's not wholly accurate. Star didn't much like me. I joined in, near the end of the last conflict. I was there when she slew the Dwarven Lord and took the sun. I argued for a different course of action, but I was just a greenhorn then. We need to make our decision early, probably. Split and sneak up, or tighten together. Speed, I'll say, is necessary either way. Um... Let's do stealth. Oh, hi. New. Uh, yes, we can get to you. 
go, pussy. Go get it. Get a tier one stone bow. Dun dun dun. <laughs> Um, go here. So oh, there's more there. Okay, so interviews with this. And then... A tree. Oh boy. I like how they're all there. Oh. Well, alarm's been sounded. This is gonna be great. Um, smack you dead. <laughs> um, I'm gonna make a beeline back because I have an idea with Sir Bob. Well, Sir Bob a lot McGee. We can splinter we can splinter blast the two of you. I like this idea. And then you shoot one dead. And you stay hidden because of that. And then you go here and Guardian. And he's dead next too. Dead. Do, 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 do. Get him tattooed. We can go kitty to your can. She runs 90 miles per hour away from you. <laughs> Did you see that? Have you seen the TikTok where it's the cat with the automatic food, uh, food dispenser and like. Literally, the minute, the, the, the second the food dispenser goes off, the cat runs at 90 miles per hour no matter where it's going. <laughs> um, let's withdraw. Dude, no, but now I gotta look that shit up. I, I, I saw it a couple of weeks ago, man, but I was laughing so hard because it's like the cow's like acting like it's starving, I swear. <laughs> oh, hi. Oh, we'll just wait. Searching, I see, okay. But if he came by, interfused with the bush, and then grabs you from afar. What's all right? All right, pussy. Shoot him! That did not kill. <laughs> I don't know if I favored it. I'm gonna take a quick jaunt to my TikTok and see if I favored it. I don't mind showing on stream because I was laughing so hard at it. But I also like a lot of shit, so. Yeah, no. <laughs> dead, 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 dead. Let's go. 
On the other side of the brief wood, there's no sign of a, a camp was ever made here. Seems like we got through that all, right? Maybe better they split their forces. They can afford to throw that many away. False trail means we go back to the stream bed. Our quarry must have traveled up, up it for a while. Ah, I'm an idiot. I should have seen this group's prints were fewer. Pussy, you were the only reason we've been gaining on them. Yes, your guess has been good on, on the whole. It's a short step for food. Then they're underway again. Sir Bob, you are talking about your past before. About Star and... Uh, Dwarven and V? I was done, basically. It was the end of, a, of the 20-year conflict. Who's Dwarveny? Dwarveny Blue was another fighter we ran with. Younger than Star, closer to my age, she, she always helped soften the hard times. Poor Dwarveny. Now there's someone your mother lit up... That's someone your mother lit up around. I don't know. I get questions, got questions myself, many of which I've never w really wanted to answer. Back tracking, they reached the stream that night. They exited the water here, I, I think. They're masking their prints, but thanks to the moon, we can see streaks of mud shine on these stones. Oh boy. Stronger creatures! Okay. Not a waste of time. What item did we get? Plus five block. Who has the lowest block? Mm, let's give it the pussy galore. Finas! <laughs> Hello, vodka. How are you doing? Do, 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 do. Has anyone seen webs yet? <laughs> Hi, Mr. Moose. Is that my new name now? Mr. Moose? His fog is so thick, I can barely see anything. We'll probably hear Thruxo before we see them at this rate. Oh, you'll love this, Vodka. You want... We have, uh, we have four new adventurers. We have Tattooed Fat Man. Uh, we have Sir Bobalot McGee. We have Erotica is Wild, or my serb if not offended, eh, either work. Uh, we have Erotica is Wild, and then we have Pussy Galore as our brand new adventurers. <laughs> this fog is so thick, you can barely see anything. We'd probably hear Turkso before we see them at this rate. Maybe. Oh. Either works. <laughs> There's an awfully pretty patch of flowers to be in a gloomy place like this. Peculiar shapes that are in, now that you mention it. Ooh. It's just me, right? That's a giant flowering footprint. This rings a bell. I remember draw drawing of this very clearly. But the context is... Give me a minute. What was that? There's something moving through the forest. Something huge. <laughs> Hang on, we're near Kaldog Weaver Works, right? Oh no. The Strider of Kaldog Weaver Works. What? A giant of terrible beauty, dooming those who look upon it. And j you're just remembering this now. Did you say doom? I remember I saw those flowers. We didn't get those blooms brewed into a tea immediately. What about the Strider? What about the Thruxel? That can wait. These are... Ivory Zia, and they'll only stay potent for a short time. Fresh Ivory Zia, when brewed, bestows high in strength and reflexes for a few hours. Now you're talking. So tell me again why we're not farming this stuff? Occupational hazards, I imagine. You saw the size of that footprint. Understandable. Plus one temporary hit points. Okay. Smack! Uh, smack. Bam, 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 bam,
interfuse with this. And then splinter blast him. That way you can kill him and go invisible. <laughs> oh my lord. Smack! <laughs> okay, blocked. Good to know. I guess we'll bone Nancy. And then we'll walk over and smack the bejesus out of you. Then we'll come here and shoot you to death. Easy peasies. Oh, that was it? All right, I'm done with this. Is it peasants? Latin squares. Uh, untouchable. Upgrade vigilance. Plus five melee, plus five ranged. Um. Eight, 100, 108, 100, 100, 112, 102. Alright. Give it the pussy galore. damage. 0. 0.6, 0. 0.4, 0. 0.6. Um, give it a strip up. And then we'll scout this tile out next to us. Assault. Sun's lowering. The canopy tosses a gentle aroma over them, like paper and sage. It's okay if they're stuck. If you're stumped, it's been a long day. Need help? Definitely a camp here. Cook fire. Can see where a kettle stand dug its foot in. Do they suddenly get less careful? Like us, they li they likely weigh and balance multiple concerns. Then there's a bird splat on the gr on the rocks, and it looks like someone was testing a blade on that trunk. Which trunk? The one by the O. The one by that door, actually. Dun dun dun. You have Specter Step. Okay. So what I'm hearing is that we need to do this and Splinter Blast the bejesus out of you. So that we can come over and smack the life out of you. Oh, there's one behind us. I did not see that one. <laughs> Hi. Get rid of your Spectre Step. Rude. Oh, there's more. Oh, but wait, there's more. Oh my, there's a lot of them. Uh huh. Do, 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 do. Interfuse with that. Interfuse with that. And then. Discus. Discus you. Dodged. Damn it. Smack! Smack again! Ow. Ow.
discus toss to you, I guess? 